Personal narrative number 20. Prim went my mom's car. Yay, I yelled. Boo, shouted my younger six-year-old brother Jonah as we played our iPods in the car. We were on our way to my dad's office in Chesterfield called mine, which is a place for special needs kids. We are here, my mom told us as we got out of the car. We ran in and yelled, hi, dad. Hi, I got you some bagels from Einstein, dad said. Yay, we say. Seven minutes later, we went to the back room, which is a gym. We started jumping off the climbing wall. Ah, I screamed as I jumped off the climbing wall. We then saw a silver car, so we had to go into a little room in the front of mine because a girl named Sophia was there. We played our iPods in the little room. I'm bored, I told my six-year-old brother Jonah. Me too, he replied as we continued to play our iPods. After an hour or so, my dad came in and asked us, do you want to go on a walk around mine? We told him, yes. So we walked out the back door in the gym. I was so excited. We saw a dog place, and when the dog saw us, they went crazy. The employees did not like it at all. A little later, we went to a place where they take care of the dogs when they are hurt or sick. As we walked in, a lady said hello. My dad started talking to her as we explored. We found a weird-looking thing. I was wondering what it was. They told us it was a water treadmill. They also told us that they put little yellow life jackets on them. We also found a little cat. It was very cute. Then it was time to leave. We walked out. We walked all the way around a tall building. A little later, we found an expensive car. It was so cool to my brother and dad. Ooh, they exclaimed. Dad took pictures and sent them to my grandpa. Finally, we went to my dad's office, mine. Then I saw my mom. She was a little worried because she did not know we were going on a walk. Finally, we calmed her down. A little later, we needed to go home to feed our dog Shatter from Maisie. So then Dad drove us home. In the car, I told my dad I had so much fun. Me too, he replies as we drove home. Over and out.